Hey guys, uh, what's up? Happy Thanksgiving. Uh, I know a lot of people have been having problems with the new widescreen YouTube. I don't know if, if you've seen it yet, but... Uh, it's been causing a lot of problems because everyone's videos are not... Like, if you take a look at, say, this one of my old videos, it's got those stupid bars on the side. But I found a way to make them look like this. Hold on. I found a way to make them look great, just like they used to be. Alright, and it's a lot of people having problems, I'll take you through that. So first what you're going to do is open Sony Vegas. You're going to make a new file, and you're going to make it 1,200 by 560. That's what the YouTube is. The new YouTube is. I don't know if it's the exact specs, but it's just about there. See, you could save it as a template. Like I, I, You could save it as a YouTube, so you can go back to it later on. Alright? And that should make the screen look like that. And then all you're going to do is, you're going to open up your video, because you need it. You can open up your video, and it should already look. Well, hold on. This one, this one, I already did it on. I can only open up another one. It, it'll look crappy like that because it hasn't been formatted yet. All right, what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to Event Pan slash Crop, and you're gonna wanna turn Maintain Aspect Ratio off. That'll let you adjust the video however the hell you want. I could make it look like this if I want to. It doesn't really matter. I will take care of it. But you can adjust it any way you want, pretty much. But to do it on this, you're going to want to turn off this one, too. It's lock aspect ratio. Because that gets really annoying when you're trying to do something. Now you're just going to stretch the video. Make it look however... however big you want. Right, I choose to make it look like this so it doesn't look completely retarded when you go on YouTube like some videos do. Alright, and as soon as you're finished with that, make sure you do it for every clip. Uh, you're going to want to go to Render As and you're going to want to make your own template again. You're going to go to Custom. You want to change the render quality to best so your video looks as good as possible on YouTube. Go to image size or the video tab and make it image size custom and make it 1200 by 560 again and change the video smoothness to 100. Or you want to double check that the internet LAN under bitrate is 3M and save it as a template. And then all you're going to want to do is render your video. Alright, this should take care of uh, any problems you have. If not, you can leave a comment on my page and I'll tell you what you might have done wrong.